Federal College, Colombo, Grade 1, Computer Study. Hello, my little boys and girls. How are y'all? I am here again to teach you more about computer studies. Can y'all remember what we learned last time? Let's recall them. What can you all see in this picture? It is a computer. We all know that a computer has different parts, isn't it? What are they? These are the basic parts of a computer. Monitor, CPU, speakers, keyboard, mouse and printer. What is this? Yes, it is a mouse. Can you remember we learned about the mouse? The mouse is an input device. It is used to choose things on the computer screen. How many buttons does a mouse have? A mouse has two buttons. Right mouse button and left mouse button. And also a scroll wheel. What are the functions of the mouse? Click, drag, and drop. Now you all know about the parts of the keyboard and the mouse. Today we are learning about the keyboard and its keys. Before you start using the computer, you must know a few things about the keyboard. So I am going to teach you the users of the keyboard, types of keys, and how to handle the keyboard with care. Let's learn the users of the keyboard. The keyboard is also an input device. It is like a typewriter. It has many small buttons on it called keys. The keyboard is connected to the CPU by a wire. A keyboard is a device which is used to type data and instructions on the keyboard. The keys on the keyboard are pressed to type letters, numbers, and symbols on the screen. There are four different types of keys. Alphabet keys, numeric keys, function keys, and special keys. Let's learn the types of keys.
alphabet keys. The keys that have the letters from A to Z on them are called alphabet keys. We use these keys to type letters or words. As there are 26 alphabet in the English language, so there are 26 alphabet keys on the keyboard. When you press the letters on the keyboard, it appears on the monitor screen. Numeric keys. Numeric keys are also called as number keys. The keys that have numbers printed over them in the keyboard are called number keys. You can type any number using these keys. These numeric keys are present on the top row above the alphabet keys and also another set is on the right of the keyboard. Numeric keys are also like alphabet keys. When you type a number, it appears on the monitor screen. Function keys. You can do special jobs using the function keys. There are 12 function keys. They are marked from F1 to F12. These keys are used to perform some special functions. So they are called as function keys. Special keys. The other keys on the keyboard are special keys. They are required to perform some special functions. Some special keys on the keyboard are spacebar, enter, caps lock, shift key, backspace, delete key, and arrow keys. Let's learn to handle the keyboard with care. Now you all know the keys on the keyboard. Do you know that you should handle the keyboard with care? Keyboard is an important part of the keyboard. So let's learn how to handle it with care. Please keep these points in mind. Do not push or pull the keyboard too hard as it may damage the wire connected to the keyboard. While typing, press the key gently and remove your finger quickly from the keyboard or else the same keys will get tied repeatedly. Lastly, do not keep anything on the keyboard such as books, CDs or food items. I hope you all understood the lesson. So let's revise about the keyboard with a fun song. I'm a keyboard kid.
When I want to make a space But not too far It's easy as can be I press the space bar I'm a keyboard kid Did you all enjoy the song? So children, that's all for today. Until next time, stay safe. Goodbye.